Microsoft announced they looked at acquiring messaging system Slack for $8 billion, but instead decided to invest the money in making Skype not work. Eric Schmidt, former CEO of Google, has been hired to head up a new innovation board at the Pentagon. Eric's first week will involve swapping army outfits for jeans and hoodies, painting tanks in primary colours, and placing interesting doodles on the side of Hellfire missiles. Also, Google has developed a system that can tell where a photo was taken just by looking at it. It found 95% of the photos on Instagram are taken just above a plate of quinoa. And final news from Google, their self-driving car got into a minor accident with a bus this week. When the artificially intelligent system was questioned about the crash, it responded, that was an unfortunate accident. And finally, CNN released an article titled How to Build a Time Machine. Sadly, it was not the plans to build a DeLorean-esque time machine. It was the collective wishes of all its viewers to travel back to a time when CNN broadcast actual news. All right, that's it. Bye. Bye, 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 bye. I also love filmmaking, and that was kind of my dream, was to make films about science. And where are you? Hello, Gray. I'm in the future, the year 2035.